Hey guys, Golix here. Welcome back to another episode of Outer Worlds. Last time we went off, we were, um, you know, taking out these Marauders. Our next, um, thing to do is, you know, right now, just, uh, retrieving the cache of medicine. Make sure, uh, um, should be easy, yeah. Make sure, uh, if I'm, um, it's always weird. Oh, that's why I'm stupid. They always keep resetting for some stupid reason. Should be better now. Oh, his foot fell off. That's... Yeah, I, I keep on getting like a big cartridge, basically. Make sure, uh, I check my inventory, make sure, uh, uh, my weight isn't, uh, you know what I mean. Okay, so I still got 30. Hmm. Let's see. Smoke, baby. Yeah, good thing I saved. The hell, man. Yeah, it's it's. I was gonna say it's tough with this because with this build character because he's got he's very squishy. I'm 
Oh no, are you serious? I didn't mean go into the menu, I meant, uh... Yes, I got like no um healing left. Oh, come on, man. There was a... I think I can, like... There's a bed I can sleep in at least. Hold on. Oh, let's see. It's just like uh, six hours, really? Uh, okay. Rest your ship bed on your ship. Yeah, fast travel because I gotta like put this stuff back and then, um, not that it sucks, just like, yeah. If you're falling sick, I don't want you near me. Don't worry, I wouldn't do that to you. Spacer's Choice, the brand of choice for spacers on a budget. Music to my ears. Yeah, let's see. I have 3% discount. All right, let's see. So, you take out the...
think like I just say, yeah, you know, let me let me see what stuff they got right there. Hammer, revolver. I can leave that alone. Oh, let's see. Guess I could take that. Hold on. Yeah, it, at least it's light armor. I only, yeah, I said I do light armor and, uh. Work your job. Okay, there we go. Music to. How much do I have? Oh, about eight. All right. Um, so. I wish you could compare, like, oh, it's like this is the gun. Now this gun or that gun, but yeah, at least I got some armor and stuff. Corrosive. I'm barely reduce the noise of each shot. Oh yeah, it's like that's pretty high. Okay, so I got some adrena time. Okay, save. And your rations yet? Yep. Two whole cans of salt tuna. I don't know you. Hmm. Amelia Kim, Spacer's Choice Beverage Dispenser. I don't know what you're about. But this here is a Spacer's Choice drinking establishment. We're all loyal, hard-working company folk here. So going on here that I should uh, know how. <laughs> Am I that easy to read? Yeah, we've been having some problems lately. Loyalty issues, lines in the sand. I know where folk in Edgewater stand. But you, I don't know you. If you're gonna have a drink, I'd like to ask that you do it within the premises. <sighs> Can't have you taking drinks over to those deserters. <sighs> Traitors. The lot of them. Bunch of folks decided they were tired of working and went out into the wilds to fend for their own selves. Town's already struggling to make quotas, even without that band of slackwits abandoning their posts. Bunch of lazy, shiftless rung leeches. Anyway, enough about them. What can I do for you? Do you now? And what makes you think Mr. Thompson wants to talk to you? He's a busy man. You want to talk to Mr. Thompson, try ignoring your duties. He'll summon you up to that great big tower atop the cannery, and you'll get yourself a proper dressing down. It is a good thing. If you're not pulling your weight, you don't deserve to live here. Simple as that. Go ahead. I don't see how that's any of your business. I'm not trying to judge you, I'm just curious, yeah. You're the first to ask after me in some time. I'll give you that. But I don't have a story to share. My family's worked Spacer's Choice for two generations, and I've lived in Edgewater just about all my life. Wanted to work in the sciences once upon a time. Would you believe it? That was a wild fancy. Glad I disabused myself. Oh, let's see. 
So, uh, so you had a dream of being a scientist. What happened? What happened, you ask? What always happens when you're dreaming? Up, and the fight team bad is just like, it's like what Spy from TF2. I got a good weapons, questions. but I'm very squishy is the thing, you know? So I did the right thing and worked the life I was always meant to live. Now that I'm behind a bar, I can ask all the questions I want. Important ones. Like, when are you going to pay your tab? And would you like another round of cold, refreshing zero G? As a question of foundation, the best science has too many. Don't talk to me that way, please. Spent many years disabusing myself of that notion. Don't need you putting it back in my head. Hmm. Lab work ain't for me. Never was. Never will be. Spacer's Choice put me where I belong. And for that, I am grateful. They did. They gave me a life. Gave me a purpose. This is where I belong. What's wrong with that? It's good, honest work. I mean, yeah, my, my friend Alec is a dishwasher, I think, in a restaurant. He, it's Unless decent work. In Byzantium. I hear everything's automated there. Not that I'll ever find out. Not so fast. I told you about my life. Your turn to tell me about yours. So, what's your story? You wouldn't believe if I told you. That right. Prove it. Let's see. I'm the last one of the colony ship. Hope everybody know. Let's see. Ah, I know that serial drama. They were playing it just the other night. What was it called? The Last Spacer? You're right. I don't believe you. I'd advise you to keep that story unsaid. Don't want people thinking you're a loon. Ugh, is this the start of a joke? If you want me to laugh at your jokes, it's a three drink minimum. Most folk forget where they're standing after a few drinks. Seems to me you've got a head start. Anyhow, whatever happens outside the walls is not my business. Only deserters and marauders mm, wander out there. And I cannot tell oh, you. Oh yeah, for this I week is like more. what is it? For this my week I'm doing two episodes of Outer Worlds. And, a row of mugs that need and then one of Supposed Attorney, I know what is it? I know uh, people, I've done some voting on Twitter and to put on Discord or whatever. People really like the idea of me doing Fall in New Vegas. So I'm like, I'm probably going to do that, record it, and put it like a four video this week on Tuesday or Wednesday. Let me make something clear. Spacer's Choice has been real good to me. The town's been real good to me. I start gallivanting around outside the walls, poking around in places I shouldn't be, learning things I've got no right to know. People will talk. <laughs> Won't ever catch me asking about the world outside. Else the town's gonna say Amelia's gone soft. That Amelia's pondering desertion. <laughs> I don't want that. It's like, I suppose we gotta do our jobs. And be satisfied with our lot in life. I've said enough. People come here to drink their problems away. They wanted to face their problems. They'd go see our vicar. Let's see. I think, uh, like, yeah, I'm gonna try to. I know I'll do the mission. I'll still do it, but I want to see if I can. I'm gonna go to the, the um, the vicar. Should be. Try, yeah, it's been a while. Oh, here it is. Sorry, I'll just be a minute. You had a minute. Next one comes out of your pay. He's off the threats, friend. I'm going. Boss's orders. We all got quotas to make. Talking to the good vicar always lifts up my spirits. Yes, what is it? You're an outsider. Fantastic. Vicar Maximilian de Soto, at your service. Or Vicar Max, if you're the sort who prefers brevity. I so rarely get new people to talk to. Name your poison, anything at all. Spiritual counseling, this season's tossball predictions, the quickest way out of town. I'm looking for a power regulator. Mechanical tomfoolery is well out of my purview. 
I suggest you take such matters to Mr. Thompson in the cannery. Oh, and a word of warning. If you're considering wandering around outside the safety of the town, you'd best be cautious. Marauders are about. Though if you are planning on venturing outside, I do have a proposition that may interest you. One of the reasons I transferred here was to fulfill my duty in hunting down banned heretical texts. I happen to know such a book is as we speak. Oh yeah, he gives you that quest if you talk to him, I forgot. However, the collector's <coughs> residence lies outside the town's walls. My retrieval efforts have been thwarted by marauders who have overrun the property. Should you fare better than me, I'd pay a handsome sum for the book. Let's see. Why the figure we have to ban her radical ball? I just want to keep the writing out of layman's hands. It wouldn't do for such information to fall into public consumption. Does he? I'll need to overwork with this book where I agree to this. It's a handwritten journal, a faded blue cover with the name M. Bakonu handwritten in the lower corner. I'll mark where I saw it on your map. Assuming you're serious? It is not only a beautiful relic of a bygone time, it's also the thoughts of an early thinker on the nature of man's place in the cosmos. Not many in this colony could understand its true value, should they ever read it. Thank you. If you retrieve it, you can always find me here. Any progress on that matter we discussed? Please get it. What would you like to discuss? Yeah, how'd you know it's an answer? I've never seen you before, and there's been no paperwork indicating a transfer. Half the time it's wrong, but a new worker without paperwork? Unheard of. Also, you lack the distinctive worker gaze. Usually either a deadening behind the eyes, or in some rare cases, a wild-eyed frenzy. Like a trapped animal. <laughs> I'm not an ass that makes one of us. Oh, nothing could be further from the truth. I'm simply bemoaning the level of spiritual awareness in this town. Is there a raise that? Yes, but there are few who hear me in this miserable place. I must double my efforts to elevate my flock. These are good, hard-working people here. Yes, and thank you for pointing it out. It is wrong of me to succumb to distress. This place could be so much more, and I will continue in my quest to make it so. You are presuming. They who are not satisfied with their work are satisfied with nothing. No. How about, um, work fortifies the spirit. True exhaustion awaits idle hands. Let's see, um, I was actually asking what the Witch was all about. The OSI teaches that the Grand Architect set a perfect system in motion at the beginning of time. Contentment is found by accepting oh, God, one's role in that grand plan. Yeah, what does OSI stand for? The Order of Scientific Inquiry, also known as scientism to the layperson. Hmm. You don't talk to the Grand Architect. Once the universe was set in motion, it stepped back. It has no concern for us. Let's see. So it's important when sites get um, pretty weak. No, not, not that one. This sounds like a very more visual. What's our aspire to? We will eventually decode the plan and all its intricacies. Once we are able to deduce the properties of every particle in the universe and its trajectory, we will know everything. The future, the past, each person's place within the plan, all will be laid out before us, removing struggle and bringing peace. No one will ever need question their path again. Some even believe this ultimate knowledge will unlock mankind's true potential, and we will all become akin to grand architects ourselves, after a fashion. Yes. Well... First, there's the matter of the secret blood rites and animal sacrifices. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Seriously, though, 
To truly understand the metaphysics involved takes years of study and contemplation. It's like I don't want to hurt the guy. It's just like ugh, that was weird. Okay, let me go to the journal. Take this out. Oh, it's on a companion task. Uh, ah, not task quest. Uh, my book collector's was a part of a small Edgewater. You're safer inside the wall. Yeah, like a should quick save. Yeah, just in case like um I run out of time, whatever, and I also get my ass beat. You know. Yeah, it's weird too that this game has no grenades, but they again they might uh fix that later in the And once again, a few more scraps, I'll, you know, be good, like get stronger and all that. Oh, what is that? Is that, uh, don't tell me, it's, um, uh, it reminds me, Turkish Delights. Oh, I love those. I know people be like, oh, dude, they, they actually suck, but I'm like, I'm... Um, to the Edgewater Cannery. Shame. Don't want those books, so I stash them all in a cave over by the river. Yeah, leave that, and then I'll do... And I'm a lone wolf. I 
Huh, that's odd. Now let's see. When the quarter ban is when we hit the ban book. Okay. All right, so um, that's gonna be it for for this one. Thanks everybody for watching. I'm gonna record the next episode as soon as I possibly can. Then do the pillars one, then do the fall one later Tuesday, Wednesday. So once again, thanks everybody for watching, and as always, I'll see you guys later.